Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do a haul of my non-toxic scents, perfumes, aromatherapy, I guess, stuff like that. And yeah, over the years I did a lot of more, a few of these hauls, and actually I included in the past some toxic products without noticing, realizing, and yeah, I hope I improved my non-toxic perfume shelf a little bit at this point and it's all clean non-toxic uh, as far as I know so if I share something and it's with chemicals I have to apologize ahead but I try to read my ingredients and I like to keep it at as clean as possible and sometimes if I'm confused I even ask the brands about their ingredients and they are confirming their ingredients with me so I really hope I'm not at fault um in any way um with my ingredients that i'm going to share today so in non-toxic world natural and organic products i notice we can have four types of scented products and we can have uh, usually kind of like perfumes or body sprays they can be in a water based they can be water based they can be alcohol based they can be oil based or as a balm so basically these are the products and i'm going to start with them uh, with the category where i have the least products so i have a balm here actually a perfume balm and growing up i remember i came across this type of products from many different brands and they still are amazing i think is the most travel friendly uh, product that you can have and this is fall bliss from bergamot cove and it's a very very cute little container here and it's a natural perfume balm and it has very very simple ingredients beeswax sweet almond oil vitamin e oil therapeutic grade essential oils and that's about it and they have several scents on their website which i really find them to be very simple and very nice and this one fall bliss it smells like cinnamon basically very spicy but cinnamony and uh, because it has vitamin e in it it's very moisturizing balm actually and what i do because i notice it doesn't really melt like um very normal balm will do this is more on the waxy type so i just scrape a little bit and actually what i do i use it as a hand moisturizer so this is how i melt it what i do with it actually what you're supposed to do you're supposed to take a little bit melt it on your finger and then just apply it to your pulse points so it works really well like that too but yeah i uh, noticed that it's an amazing moisturizer especially for my hands and that's what i been doing actually and it's because it's extra waxy um the smell the scent is gonna linger for a while and yeah the zero waste plastic free container it's also very very cute and travel friendly like i mentioned this doesn't melt in the summertime and yeah i've been loving this little cute container then we have i have one product um a product in a water base and is this um gem elixirs focus and it's a very intriguing product it even has gems inside as you can hear maybe um hence the name gems elixir and this product it's um water based product and it has essential oils of jasmine lavender lemon rosemary and natural spring water like i mentioned and it says it pro promotes focus reduces errors and increase produ productivity and test scores so it's an aromatherapy gemstone spray and it's proven to work wonders so Especially when I'm working here at the computer, usually I put it right here and I have it and I just spritz around, sometimes just in the air and I just inhale. Or you can just spray yourself with it because it's just water-based and essential oils. Uh, but yeah, basically it says to improve focus. So it's a very intriguing product. 
actually and most of the natural perfumes are made with essential oils if you guys were wondering sometimes they have other kinds of um kind of like scented oils i think they are called sometimes um because sometimes essential oils are not pure like um you can make vanilla essential oil so sometimes they call it um scented i guess oils um so the usually vanilla it's an extract it's not an essential oil then we're gonna move on to alcohol based products and i even made my own you probably seen uh, it's a very simple basic recipe you only need some grain alcohol and then essential oils and i made mine i think i have here vanilla and lavender and this it's something so basic for me and I don't know I just love this kind of scents but basically you can use your um, most love essential oils combined and this one is with grain alcohol so if you prefer water you can do it with water and let's see I have lately I received some um, around kind of like Valentine's Day I was sent some uh, beautiful beautiful scented um alcohol based uh, perfumes and i'm gonna mention all of them and these are the biggest bottles that i have now in my collection and you probably seen this on my instagram this is face theory and this is the scent in zero one and basically this is this is one of their newest release scents uh is their first perfume that they released this year actually and the ingredients in this it has base cedarwood sandalwood and patchouli a slightly smoky halo of dark rich balsam um shrouded in velvet pine and it has mm, oh this scent it's i'm gonna try to describe it it's kind of based on orange kind of at first glance this smells a lot of like orange but it has so the top scent is orange whole leaf clary sage and then the heart is whole leaf which i have no idea what it is cardamom and geranium and then the base is cedarwood sandalwood and patchouli so it's a very earthy kind of woodsy based uh, scent with an orange kind of like overall you know you know how should i say this the top like the first you're gonna smell is the orange i actually I enjoy this a lot but i think i'm gonna enjoy it more in the summertime because i feel like some scents they smell better in the summertime like this warmth kind of scents in a way but it's not overly fruity if you guys were wondering this is more like earthy like to me um it's really hard to describe sometimes and i really like that they offer a sample uh with their full size so you can just try it um risk-free if you don't like it you just send the full size back and yeah i, I noticed a lot of um perfumes they are doing that right now and yeah i think it's the best way to try a perfume without committing to spend all the money but even though this is pretty affordable this scent is about 50 dollars and yeah scents can be extremely extremely expensive sometimes next we have the dossier scents as you probably seen on my instagram these are vegan cruelty free scents non-toxic sustainable and they are removing the designer brand markups uh, which they, it makes them really more affordable than most um, perfume on the market that you might find in uh, malls and uh, perfume stores usually they are overpriced because they want to sell in different kind of stores so just because it's an, an independent brand the price is more affordable and what i really like this uh these are 30 dollars 29 dollars per bottle so very very affordable plus they have scents created by very very famous scents and i have here i still got their bottles um 
you can also get this uh, with a sample and you can try the sample first and if you don't like it you can just send it back and you don't have to spend the money and I have here the beautiful spicy vanilla and this is inspired by Tom Ford Noir or the perfume and it smells so beautiful. The top notes are nutmeg, black pepper and lemongrass, middle notes rose patchouli oris and base note vanilla amber and opoponax which I have no idea what it is. But it smells, it's, so, it's gonna be so hard to describe this, but slightly vanilla-ish is not something that it takes you to a holiday. It's probably like a tropical um, holiday somewhere, but it's so smooth. This, this scent is so smooth and so beautiful. I can't even describe it. Probably one of my most loved uh, scents by now spicy vanilla um, it's really really beautiful and then we have spicy orchid and this one it's inspired by Tom Ford black orchid uh, top notes cinnamon pink pepper mandarin middle notes ilyang and uh, orchid and plum and base notes sandalwood, vanilla, incense, and patchouli. So let's smell this. Okay, so this is sweeter than the spicy vanilla. It's definitely kind of like um, more floral um, and more sweet scent. It's, if I had to pick this, I wouldn't pick because I don't like sweet scent so much. But it, this is so luxurious. It feels like so luxurious in some point. It's amazing. Like seriously, it's... That's why this uh, scents, they definitely blew me away because they are so well done. And they have so many layers to it. You know, after you use it once and you let it, you know, evaporate a little bit, you... you smells such different notes in it and yeah I was totally obsessed with this and um, because uh, Glossier sent this beautiful amazing scent to me they also offered me a 10% uh, coupons to share with my followers so I'm gonna link it down below also during the Valentine's Day I was sent this beautiful um, kit from Pure Love Essences. They sent me the Pure Love Discovery, uh, Pure Love Discover set, and this is a small woman-owned business, handcrafted in USA fragrances with only high-quality essential oils. Uh, these uh, they have uh, also in their bottles. They have beautiful, beautiful gems, and as you can see, the Moroccan has. Uh, Mazonite, I believe. It has uh, notes of golden amber and oceanic musk and exotic coconut. And let's see if I can smell it. Oh, okay. If I said the previous uh, scent was sweet, actually was more on the floral side. Now that I compare it to this one, and this one has like a kind of like. So the Moroc Moroccan is golden amber, ocean musk, and exotic coconut. So it kind of has that kind of like a salty coconut kind of scent. Kind of, if I had to describe it. And then we have here the semi this cute little kit. And we have the boho scent in here. And boho is genuine, it has genuine rose quartz stone in it, warm woods, mystical amber, and jasmine. Ooh. It's really hard to smell like this. Oh, okay. And I really like that they have an oil based, uh, the same perfume they have it oil based or alcohol based like a mist so you can choose which one you want and 
you can try their mini kit uh, I have a code with 20% off so you can uh, try a mini kit if you would like and the discovery set um, you can save 20% with brush 20 and I really like that when you try it then you can actually so these scents they don't contain water fillers or carrier oil the mist spray contains 35% fragrance oils and they are certified clean vegan and cruelty free plus fully refundable when you purchase a full size product so when you try a mini kit like this the little samples um, then you can choose a full size at the 35 um, so the price it's fully refundable that you paid for the kit and uh, like I mentioned they have genuine amazonite and turquoise stone in the um, the full size bottle of the Moroccan one the rebel scent has genuine black tourmaline which is a protection stone and boho has a genuine rose quartz stone for love and yeah amazing amazing discovery kit and then i have an um, acobella scent uh, i have it i have it i had this for quite a while actually and um they have some basic scents uh, on their website they have four scents they have organic ambrosia organic bourbon vanilla organic lavender and lemon verbena so these are all organic scents i have the organic ambrosia and this is handcrafted with the egyptian geranium black currant bud absolute and bulgarian lavender so it says it adds warmth of tropical ginger, cardamom, clove, and the mystical patchouli plus hypnotic, hypnotic vanilla. And yeah, it's amazing. Kind of like it has a lot of layers too, I noticed. But I think I smell a lot of patchouli in it. And uh, definitely the. Ambrosia is definitely a warm, a warm scent. It's so hard to describe because um, if I think right now, I think I will have opted more for the vanilla one, probably because I like vanilla warm scent, vanilla scents, or uh, the lavender one. But because lavender is so, I don't know. I've had a lot of lavender lately i wanted to kind of try something new and i thought uh, vanilla will be too basic but yeah this is something that i wouldn't pick if i had to smell it so i just i guess went with my intuition and this doesn't smell like anything that i have in my collection <laughs> uh also each bottle um this is one ounce retails for $35 which is very affordable too and you can see I used a little bit out of this bottle because it's not my favorite um, I liked more musky or tea uh, spicy scents and this is nothing like that this is more of a patchouli sweet scents um, it definitely smells uh, sweet it doesn't smell nothing I don't smell any ginger cardamom or clove in it and yeah that there was a little bit disappointment I guess because uh, by reading the ingredients uh, I expected that it also has uh, lavender and geranium I don't smell that either so I guess it's not strong enough I don't smell yeah it's it's just nothing that I expected this I bet a lot of people will love that, but it's just not me. So now I'm gonna get into my oil based perfumes. Uh, usually they have um, some of these, they might have uh, fractionated coconut oil, sometimes they have, I notice even jojoba oil, which is a great moisturizer. Um, so it doesn't matter which oil they contain because you apply them on your skin. Uh, basically you want something that is as close as possible to your natural oils I guess uh, I notice fractionated coconut oil it's widely used because it's very absorbent to the skin or jojoba oil which um, it's also um, 
very very similar to your um, natural oil on your skin so that's why it's widely used I'm gonna start I have here some beautiful aroma therapeutic um, blends from lavender and gems and this is an Etsy shop and these are made so beautiful uh, before uh, it was called lavender and gems the shop was called uh, oil Tram tribe mom shop uh, that's why I still have these um, stickers on mine uh, with the oil trial oil tribe mom shop but now it's called lavender and gems and she creates such beautiful products she has some um, gems on her website essential oil sprays uh, bracelets skincare beauty dried herbs uh, earrings I see now and rings so you can definitely check her store out because the products are so affordable and I have this beautiful blend in energy and you can see uh, it's include she includes also dry uh, flowers in there there look so beautiful and some gems and we have energy energy blend I think it's probably one of my favorite so it's using 100% pure therapeutic grade essential oils and fractionated coconut oil and this one the energy blend it has sage and peppermint leaves and it smells so beautiful I don't know what it is about because it's not very pepperminty and I love sage sage but it's not I don't know sometimes sage can be so overpowering and this is not so it's really hard to believe it's just sage and peppermint in here I don't know it smells so good for me it's kind of like a sweet peppermint scent and I like applying this a lot um, I don't know it just it gives me such a good uh, mood very uplifting mood it makes me happy I guess and then we have the unicorn you can see the unicorn and then we have the beautiful gems inside it has these beautiful beautiful gems I really love this and it has citrine crystals coconut oil blue tansy oil birch oil Siberian fur oil and copaiba oil and I noticed this one it's a very unique scent it has kind of like a medicinal scent to it I can tell you this because now this was not my favorite um, it smells kind of pepperminty comfort-y I don't know definitely like a medicine and I realized that because it has such amazing ingredients in it um, I might use it as a moisturizer because yeah why not it has coconut oil and blue tansy in it and just some essential oil so I might do that or even on my hair because yeah my hair needs hydration too so yeah but definitely the scent it's very uplifting and energizing uh, but it's not something that as I will pick um, I don't know if I had to pick this scent I wouldn't just go for it so these were sent to me so I guess that's how I end up with it and then I end up with my favorite from the bunch this cute little perfume bottle that you can see here retails for $14.99 and it's the cutest little thing this makes the perfect little cute gift uh, this is my favorite from the ones that I got from Oil Tribe Mama uh, from Lavender and Gems and it has this beautiful amethyst uh, I believe in there uh, this is called Hot Mass Blend uh, perfect for mom or anyone living a busy lifestyle blend of citrus flora grounding oils and vanilla and this is my favorite from all of them that I got from her and I don't know how to describe this <laughs> it just smells so good and um, it's so smooth it's such a smooth scent and the uh, bottle is so cute and yeah you can just toss it in a purse because it's so tiny and cute and even though it looks so tiny I think it then I'm gonna mention an old favorite that I don't know why I don't just use it up. I have here a sample of the XO Root Pretty um, Oil. 
and I don't know why I don't just use this up I have this for a really long time this is EXO perfume non-toxic and alcohol free scent um, it has jojoba oil, organic lavender, essential oil, organic rose geranium and jasmine some back. Very very simple ingredients but this scent, I don't know, it just calls my name. I have to get a full size of this. I keep saying that, I'm just gonna do it uh, because seriously this is so well done. And they say you can even apply it in your hair. Um, you can make your hair smell amazing too I guess. So very basic oil smelling amazing now i have an amazing roll-on from red soap and co and this is called nirvana and this is intense i can tell you this right now this is so me and i was a little bit on the fence if this is natural or not because the smell it doesn't smell like a natural scent if you try their soaps uh they have amazing amazing kind of like skincare and um, soap line and they all they have kind of the same scent so you can get all their products with a certain scent and nirvana is just so beautiful but a lot of them they are and i asked them what kind of oils actually uh because it says they are scented with um natural fragrance oil and they said essential oils and these are coconut oil based natural fragrance oil hemp vetiver and tobacco and i'm obsessed with this scent i love like i said something earthy and because of the tobacco scent this is so beautiful i think it's a unisex scent i think this might suit men too and it's just i don't know it's perfection for me it's very very beautiful i'm totally obsessed with this and then I have, let's see, we have here a, a very beautiful and unique product. And you don't really come across something like this too often for a <laughs> essential kind of oil blend. This is Wilder North Night Bloom Mood Enhancing Roll-On. And it looks so, so beautiful. You can see it has this rose gold color to it. And even though it has that beautiful color, it doesn't really leave um, a color on your skin. And it says you can roll on a neck, wrist or even face. So like a moisturizer. It's a fractionated coconut oil based and it has prickly pear seed oil. Jasmine. We have the titanium dioxide iron oxide that gives a color. And rose gold color mica. So it's a very basic oil fractionated coconut oil and pretty pierced oil so I'm gonna use this as a face moisturizer basically um, but it smells really really beautiful like jasmine so it's just jasmine based moisturizer but it, it's very very intense so probably jasmine is not one of my most loved scents uh, but yeah I realize sometimes that uh, it's enhancing your mood even if you don't like it sometimes those scents are triggering something and um, especially now in the springtime I think this is perfect uh, to to be used so I'm gonna show you how it looks like because it doesn't have a color per se As you can see I apply it there on my hand but after you rub it in and it goes into the skin it doesn't leave any color at all but it's such a beautiful mood boosting i guess when you see this beautiful color um yeah and the scent is just straight jasmine uh, one roll on is 22 dollars and it's 10 milliliters and it's just very very beautiful okay now we have since we are more on the aromatherapy at the end of this video i guess I have a hint of lavender oil perfume from Inkling Scents. This retails for mini roll-on, $25. A bigger one, it's $40. Top notes, mint, orange, peel, bergamot, and lemon. Middle notes, chamomile, jasmine, and white amber. 
and base notes lavender green tea and magnolia so it's a very 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 well done scent and when I smell this it's like I smell fresh cut grass with a mix of lemon that's my first impression of this scent so if you like those kind of lemony scents you're probably gonna love this it's a very refreshing scent even though it says a hint of lavender <laughs> uh, this is very fresh and happy and it's spring it's calling springtime to me like I don't know it's when everything all your senses are awakening after a long winter this is a very happy scent very happy very I don't know it's just so beautiful I definitely smell uh, like I meant um, mint orange peel baramat and lemon just lemon I smell the lemon probably I don't know if it has any green tea in it yes it has green tea and lemon that's what I smell in it but it's very very smooth and beautifully done so yeah if you want to try that and then we have province apothecary uplift this is on the aromatherapy side uh, this is a very very beautiful blue frosted frosted glass as you can see and this kind of has more of a medicinal kind of scent to it this retails for 32 dollars and it has fractionated coconut oil jojoba seed oil bergamot geranium cedarwood frankincense iliang jasmine rosemary and it has a bunch of organic ingredients in it amazing amazing quality ingredients and the scent of this is definitely floral it smells strongly floral i can smell the geranium in it iliang slightly jasmine the jasmine is not as overpowerful i can smell really the rosemary in it uh, or the cedar wood bergamot probably but yeah it's a very floral scent and yeah i'm just gonna leave it at that <laughs> i'm not really a big fan of florals but um you know what's beautiful when you can layer uh, all these roll-ons you can layer them so you can use combine you can combine them and don't just use it straight up if you don't like one you can combine it with something else last but not least we have the 100 pure aromatherapy oil stress relief um roll-on and this is so affordable i was really really surprised uh it's a very very normal bottle like all the others and this is 14 dollars and it has apricot kernel oil based coconut oil and it has peppermint spearmint vitamin e and eucalyptus uh, essential oil so amazing oils and it has kind of this it kind of smells like sweet mint like a sweet mint like a spearmint i guess scent it's very very refreshing and and because it has kind of this um menthol also in it i kind of feel it like it's like a medicinal kind of type of oil perfect for um oh, oh okay eucalyptus too it's kind of like um when you get sick kind of in the winter time or you know that type of oil apply temples in the wrists soles of your feet or behind the ears so yeah this is uh, something that i think of when i have a cold and i my you know your sinuses will be stuck i guess you will smell on this that's exactly how i feel when i smell this it's very minty and yeah usually mint is relieving stress so yeah I want to say it's my cup of tea i have something uh, similar i um i wasn't gonna mention it um but it's migra still migraine stick for headaches um something similar to that um and it's the same you can apply it on your temples forehead and it has 
Uh, this one has uh, peppermint, spearmint, and lavender in coconut uh, fractionated to coconut oil. So something very very similar. I'm sure there are many basic uh, ingredients like this uh, and products on the market. Uh, but yeah, this is from 100% pure and it's very affordable. So. So yeah, that was my video with my natural and organic scents and perfumes that I own right now. And yeah, let me know if you guys uh, tried any of these products or what are your favorites. Uh, I'd love to discover more. Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, please subscribe. And if you have any questions, please put them down in the comments down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.